Welcome back to the show, everyone. Yo, I told you we got that deuce deuce, that double feature. Featuring one lock Cole from Final Fantasy VI, who was now part of the City of Final Fantasy roster. Now, here's the thing. When I woke up this morning, I was not expecting this. I forgot that there was a stream for the damn game, because when I got up this morning, you know what Square Enix stream was in my face? The one for Million Arthur Arcana Blood, which I really hope gets localized in Asia, because there's no way it's coming out in America, because it's just not. I'm not even holding out hope for that. Like... There used to be a torch that used to burn that whole fighting climax ignition that somebody at Atlas would get around and translate it. No. No, just import the damn thing. But look, one lock hole. Like, he was one of the great things that I enjoyed about my time playing Final Fantasy. The other one was suplexing a motherfucking train. But who doesn't enjoy suplexing fucking trains, right? But when I really think about what this pick really means for the minutia for the city of Final Fantasy is this should have been Riku, but that's the default answer because this is me and that's Riku. Something about Terra Strong and then it gets crazy after that. But I really think and I'm going to give the trailer the opportunity to really show me what Locke brings to the table because for real, like on this channel, me, Jay, and, and my little brother, Ryan Brahma, we did a live stream Friday night when the, when the beta was up that weekend, and I played it, and I played the city, and I was unimpressed. And I was so unimpressed that when it was time to decide whether or not I buy like, man, I wait for a sale. It seems that I wasn't the only one that thought this way. And that's true. It just seems, it's just like, I play that game, and all I wanted was... Bring the CD of Duo Decim, make it HD or whatever, absolute characters. They trying to do this three on three stuff. That game was made for an arcade setting. I don't know how home you get with that because of online and how weird it can get. But like I said, when I played that beta, I was unimpressed with the city. And I hate saying that live on camera, but yeah, here we are. And there's something in my nose. I don't care. I ain't got no man's on the fuck. It was something in my nose. If it was something in my nose, you'd have scratched it too. Fuck you. Look, I don't know what to really think about this. Like, again, when you think about the, you have four. One of them is already featured in the game, and that's Zidane. You have Locke now in the game. There's no Yuffie, and there's no Riku, which this game actually desperately needs. Because, hell, but at the same time, there's no Yuna yet. And given that I think about that, is that you really wonder... Is Yuna going to be the same character when she ultimately makes it in this game? Because I really think that she is. Is that if there are any two characters from Final Fantasy X that are going to make it in, it's going to be Yuna and it's going to be Seymour because he was the character that was originally supposed to be on the side of Chaos in the original city before they replaced him with a more safer pick than Jet. And Jet's an amazing character, but I think Seymour would have been really cool. Guados and racism, blah, 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 right? Blah, blah, blah. Look regardless of all of that I'm going to give this trailer everything it needs to be what it is because I want to see what's up with this character no this character does not suplex trains he loves to mack women and steal things but he's not a thief but you don't worry about it it's cool but like I told you this is a two time two time double feature so after we get done with this I got another video to show you it's something that usually that for missile usually come out with when new characters are revealed so we can see what's really good with the character up close and personal so I figure that'll be a fun little bonus um before we get started let me do that thing that I love to do booyah trailer right there in the corner how you love that so with all of that being said we're going to take a look at revealtrailer.exe and it feels something in my nose, and I do not know why. But Jimmy Crack Corn and Triple the God don't get. But I don't care about a lot of that. That's another conversation. Look, let's activate Retrieve Trailer.exe. Let's see what's up with my boy Lock Cole putting it in the mix, and we gonna do what it is we do. Now activating Reveal Trailer.exe. Rated T for Teen for booty and violence and curse words. Fuck shit, Count Scooby the Doo Bop. Made by people. Team Ninja. Okay. No, Tina Bay. Um, Moogles. Okay, Moogles twerking. Moogles. I, I don't like. Okay. Okay. I'm like, I like this look for. Ooh. Mm. Okay. Oh, wall splash. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, I'm with this like this. Mm, mm, mm. Yo, if the beta presented me with how dope this looks, then maybe I would have cared more. Mm. Uh uh. Okay. I am totally. Okay. Make it rain. Oh, what was that? Mm mm mm. Uh uh. Just dumping on fools. Uh uh uh. <laughs> so when it's all sometime before the end of June we got a lot of stuff coming out in June we got a lot of stuff man yo and that is that boy Lock Cole um I'm gonna do something real quick y'all hold on for a moment let me do let me do some adjusting here let me do some adjusting. Y'all can't see what's going on, but don't watch me. Don't watch me. Just sit up here while I make these small adjustments. Now I make these small adjustments. Let me hit some buttons here. Okay, and we're gonna hit one more button. There we go. As I told y'all, I had a I had a second video up. It's usually what Famitsu does when new characters come out. So let me now. Y'all didn't hear that. That was nothing. That was nothing. And boom, yeah. Okay, so that's what it is. All right. So magic button. I like what I saw from Lock. So we finna see a whole lot more from the boy. So we're going to activate for Miss Who Plays the Game dot exe, and we're gonna see what's up with Lock Cole because that's what we're gonna do. So now activating for Mitsu did a thing and made a trailer, uploaded to YouTube, then I uploaded, and now I'm using it as the river to work dot exe. All right. Okay, basic attack strings. Okay, we can do that. Mm -hmm. A basic attack. Okay. Full knockdown away. I'm assuming it has some kind of follow up, at least what we saw from the trailer. So, okay. Let's see what this attack string is all about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look, that projectile is kind of dope. Like, like I like how it put him in that stuff. It remind me of Warrior of Light move from the city where he would throw the sword and then he would, like, dash in on him afterwards. So. Mm. Okay. I'm with that, too. That look, okay. Rising uppercut and then a spike to the ground. All right, so. I'm a, but I'm assuming, like, well, from what I played in the game, that most of this stuff, even though it has knockdown, that it does have follow-ups that can come with going to other moves that go into bravery to AP moves in, in some instances, very rarely. Okay, that's a whole different combo right there. Let's see, that's a jump, uh, or two, and that's flat, and that's flat away. Okay, all right, I'm with you. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what we got here. Damn, what? Oh, wow, what? Throw foot to the wall. Oh, that wall splat is dirty. That is a dirty ass wall splat. No bullshit. That is a dirty ass wall splat. I ain't even gonna lie. Mm, mm. I'm, like, I'm really feeling these moves. I really like that he got these moves that, that really because, especially on dashes to get in, but it's like. For what I played in the game, it's like it's real easy to get blown up on stuff like that. So it's not real. It's like it looked good, but getting blown up for okay. Damn! It ain't with the dirty work right there. Uh, one, one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and he's gone. Team Rocket blasting off again. <laughs> I love that joke. All right, what's this? Hmm. Okay. Well, hold on. It looked like a stun that can follow up into something, but I'm assuming that this is going to show us what it is. So. I guess this is... Hmm? Oh, oh, he has two different versions of it, depending on whether he's an EX or not. Okay, fair enough. All right. Hmm. Man, he just made it rain on him literally with a bag of money. Like, that's dirty as hell. Like, what's this? Mm, damn, what? 
Yo, one, and two, three, four, five. Dang, kick seven, eight hit combo, and that's a wall splat, too. Man, his, man, this, man, his stuff with EX is grimy. Okay, he just threw every magic spell at the world at him. Fire! Ice! Thunder! This gets better and better every second. Hmm. Full charge. So I guess, I guess this must be a um must be a special move that charges what though? It does something, but because I can't read Japanese, I don't know what the hell it is, and I'm not gonna sit there and pretend that I do. But yo, that was pretty dope. That boy Locke looked pretty gangster. Like we'll be seeing him, we'll be seeing him around there in the base god, I would assume, given everything else that comes out, so I don't know. So what's June right now? Like fight the X layer and Locke coming out. I might have to really sit down and give the city a real try, you know what I'm saying, when the price drop a little bit, you know what I'm saying, I get a little extra cheese, because, you know, yo, keeping the lab up, man, that's how it work. just putting it out there for you. But, yo, we are going to take another commercial break, and when we come back, we've got giant robots. We've got giant robots, so be prepared for giant robots. Chicks dig giant robots, and I will make that joke again after these commercial methods. So go ahead, handle your business, get some more of your popcorn, go take a piss, do whatever, and we'll be right back after these commercial messages. <laughs> 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 